is your rotten egg Ryan. Your spinach. Your spoiled meat. And your lumpy potatoes. Now you better get eating, or else I'll expend your grounding for even further. Do I make myself clear? Oh, for the sake of the devil, fine. I will eat all of this pile of dog shit, if that'll get you to shut the fuck up and leave my room. Hey, you better watch your mouth, boy. I am your father, and you don't ever talk to me like that, and I mean, ever. But enough chit-chatting with you. I am getting out of your room, and all of the food better be gone by the time I get back. Understood? Yes, sir. I will do what you said. Now that's a good boy. Okay, I will leave your side right now. Hope you have a horrible time eating all of the dog shit on the side of your bed. <laughs> oh my fucking god. This pile of nasty foods really gives me a belly ache and makes me want to puke all around my room. I just don't get why me and my teenagers next door crew are forced to eat all of this pile of garbage, but not the adults next door. Like come on, it's just so not fair. The adults next door are the ones who deserve to eat nothing but all of these gross foods that me and my friends have been eating. We don't deserve to be eating all of this, as it can also give us some nasty gas farts, which smells absolutely disgusting. And what's even worse is that many people all around Vion City supports those stupid adults next door heroes, and not as teenagers next door villains. They instead decided to hate us for no good reason. God, just thinking about all of that makes me feel incredibly angry as hell. So angry that I can't control my anger. Those stupid people should be liking us teenagers next door villains, and hate the stupid adults next door heroes, since we are way better than them. They don't deserve to get supported on for what they do to us. Getting us all into trouble. That's what pisses me off the most. They always like to get us all into trouble and get us grounded by our parents for dumb reasons. I just really want revenge on them, so that I can teach them not to get me and the rest of my crew all into serious trouble for no reason. <sighs> Well, as far as I can tell, there are no ideas for me in mind on to what trouble I should do to the adults next door. So instead, I am just going to get my laptop out of my closet, so that I don't start losing my temper over it. Okay, now that my laptop is out of my closet, all I'm gonna do is just watch some boring YouTube videos, since that I have nothing better to do, because why not? What is this I'm looking at? Huh? I have never seen this grounded video before in my life. It says, could when she swaps the adamantium's genders slash grounded upcoming video. Say, that looks pretty interesting in my honest opinion. I think I might as well watch it and see how he really does it. Wow. That was incredibly epic for Kuan Shi to do. I can't believe that he actually swapped the Adamantium's genders, which they totally deserve for being alongside with the adults next door. Oh, and speaking of the adults next door, I think that this video has just gave me the perfect idea. I will do exactly what my friends Kuan Shi did. I am going to swap the adults next door's genders, just to see their priceless reactions. Oh, this will have to be a good one, because they will also look so funny and stupid at the same time. Wow, am I really a genius or what? Ha 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 But however, instead of doing it alone, I will call one of my teenagers next door members, so that they can help me out on this. But who should it be? Oh I think I already know. It can be really. I believe that she is the only one that is going through the same hellhole as me as for today, so I might as well call her and tell her about what the both of us will do to the adults next door. Okay, I will call her right now. Um, hello, who is this? You have reached Orly and Gnurgently. What do you want? Hey Orly. It's me, Orion. Oh, hey Orion. Nice to talk to you again after not seeing each other in person. What's up with you today? Any ideas on what trouble that you and I should cause today? Well as a matter of fact, yes, I do. But before I tell you, may I ask you one question first? Sure thing bro. What is it? Well, do you remember when our most hated enemies called the adults next door always gets us dangerous troublemakers into trouble for no reason? Oh, you bet I do. Those guys really piss me off so much. 
Every time I think about them, it makes me want to bang my head on the wall millions of times without stopping. I just can't get them off my chest for always blaming everything on us. What about you? I feel the exact same way as you do. And not only that we kept getting into trouble for stupid reasons, but we are also forced to eat nothing but nasty and disgusting foods on a daily basis for every breakfast, lunch, and even dinner. My parents are always being so unfair to me, and I can't take it anymore. Same opinion as you. My mom always likes to get me sick by forcing me to eat all the dog shit. Whenever I eat one little taste of it, it either makes me want to puke or have some nasty gassy farts coming out of my ass. And I am getting really sick of getting treated like a slave. And if only there was a way to avoid getting grounded and eating all the gross foods we are forced to eat, we would do it right away. But unfortunately, I'm afraid that won't happen for a long time, since that it doesn't look like it will. Yeah, you are probably right. But anyways, what evil scheme do you have in mind for us to cause more trouble? Well, I was thinking that maybe, you and I can swap the adults next door's genders, using Vyond logic. I got this idea from the YouTube video I just watched, and it's called Couldn't She Swaps the Adamantium's Genders Slash Grounded. And that is the exact same thing we're doing, just as two, since that our other three friends Andrew, Ethan, and Isabel are not available for right now, while you are the only one that is. So, what do you say? Are you in for my evil plan or what? Oh my god. That is a brilliant idea you got there. Sure thing, I will most definitely help you out on this evil plan. Those five shitheads won't know what's coming to them. And boy I can't wait to see how funny and stupid they will look after we swap their genders. Well I'm glad you like it. How about we just meet each other at the front of their house? And we can meet up right now. Time doesn't matter this time. Okay, sure. I will meet you over there in a jiffy. I am super excited to do this with you. Okay. Then it's a deal. See you over there, Ollie. See you over there as well, Orion. Goodbye. Alright. It looks like I already called my friend Dory and told her about what my evil scheme was. But without further ado, I am going to sneak fully escape from my house, pray that I don't get caught by my family, and then meet Uli right in front of our enemy's house. Oh this will be so much fun. And it's about to start very, very soon. This will be totally worth it. Ha 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 Okay Orion, are you ready to get this evil plan in action? Oh, I am born ready. Those five adults next door punks will for sure get themselves embarrassed after we swap their genders. Now let's go inside their house, and pray that our evil plans don't get fucked up like the last million did. Ha 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 Oh wow, this has got to be one of the funniest shows we've ever watched. Yeah, I agree with you Andy. Even myself can't stop laughing at this. Ha ha. Oh, I have never laughed this hard in all my life. You got that right. There is no other show that could be funnier than this. Agreed with all of you. Nothing can spoil our laughing moments. Oh, you have got to be kidding us right now, Orion and Early. What are you two doing here? You are not welcome here. Now both of you get out of our house, before we call the cops to place you two under arrest, as you are trespassing onto our property, which is very illegal. No, we are not going anywhere. And we don't care what you say, because we are here to do something to you. Oh no. Not more trouble coming from you guys. You better not even think about doing something bad, or else you two are in for it. Now piss off, you jerks. No, never. We are not leaving this house until we give each and every one of you a taste of our own medicine. Oh my god. Would you just leave already? We're in the middle of watching some TV. Now, get the hell away from us and leave this household right this instant. For the last fucking time, no. 
We are not leaving. How many times do we have to repeat ourselves? And how many times do we have to repeat ourselves about telling you to leave our sites? This is your final warning. Either both of you leave our sites, or we will call the police and have you two removed from our house. Your choice. Oh my god. For the last time, no. We're not leaving your stupid house. You know what? That's it, we have had enough of this bullcrap. We're going to swap all of your genders just to see how you five punks like it. Wait, what? Did you just say you are going to swap our genders? What are you deaf? You heard what my friends already said. We are going to swap your genders for always getting us into trouble for no reason. Yeah. And since that enough time is wasting, we're doing it right now. So, get ready to feel embarrassed by us. No 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 Wait, what happened to us? I don't know. And wait, why do we sound different all of a sudden? Wait, what has happened to you guys? Why do you look so different? You look different too. Um, guys. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, I think I know what really happened. I think that our genders, genders got swapped. swapped. But how? How did our genders get swapped? I don't know. Someone must have done this to us. And I wonder who that is. Oh, we did. We swapped your genders to see your priceless reactions. This is what you five idiots deserve for always getting me, Uli, and the rest of our teenagers next door crew all into trouble for dumb reasons. Yeah, I agree with Orion. And oh my god, just look at all of you. You look so funny, stupid, ugly, and retarded. We can't believe that we actually swapped your genders to look like this, and it felt totally worth it. So how does it feel you big babies? Pretty embarrassing for you huh? Well we don't care. It's only funny if you get embarrassed. And we can't stop laughing our asses off at this. This is just so priceless. <laughs> oh shit, I think we are in deep trouble now. Yeah, you're not wrong, Orion. I think they are about to explode in this. You, dead, what? Oh 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 my god. Orion and Early, how could you two do this to us? Why on God's green earth would the both of you have the audacity to swap all of our genders? That is just so messed up and uncalled for. Now it all makes sense. No wonder why our genders have been swapped. And it was by you two sick bastards who had the bright idea by swapping our genders on purpose all because we get you into trouble. We had a reason to you know. Now look at what you two punks did to us. We now look like completely different people, which we absolutely despise. That's it. We have had enough of the both of you. You better change us back to our normal selves, or else there will be serious consequences coming your way. Now change us back, right now. Thank you. Now because of what you two did, instead of calling the police, we will just call your parents and tell them what you did. And you two are very lucky that you won't be getting arrested today, since that we don't want our day to get ruined even more. Just get out of our house, and go home while we phone your parents about this. Orion, how freaking dare you swap the adults next door's genders, along with Early. Swapping their genders is highly unacceptable. Who cares if they get you into trouble? It's you that gets yourself into trouble. That is the most stupid excuse to ever do that to someone. You know what Orion? That's it. You are grounded until next summer of 2024, so you are grounded for a whole year. And while you are grounded, you will be eating nothing, 
but lumpy potatoes, Swiss cheese, maggots, raw eggs, cockroaches, stinky tofu, spinach, raw vegetables, spoiled meat, prunes, and many more disgusting foods for every single meal, including dessert. Now, go to your room right this minute, you big time troublemaking brother of ours. <coughs> Really? How freaking dare you swap the adults next door's genders, along with Orion? You should know that swapping people's genders is highly unacceptable. And not to mention that the adults next to door despises having their genders swapped. And who cares if they get you into trouble when it is you that gets yourself into trouble? That is not an excuse to do that young lady. You know what? That's it. You are grounded until next fall of 2024, so you are grounded for 15 months. And while you are grounded, you will be eating nothing but lumpy potatoes, Swiss cheese, cockroaches, magus, stinky tofu, raw eggs, raw vegetables, spinach, spoiled meat, prunes, and many other gross foods for every single meal, including dessert. Now, you're right now. You know, he's spoiled sister of ours. Wow.